Hi, I'm Missy Martinez, and I'm the National High School Program Coordinator for Students for Life of America. And today, we're going to talk about how to run a meeting. Set an agenda. Students for Life has created sample meeting agendas for you to use. So take them, customize them for your club, and use the agendas at the meeting, and stick to them. It's a great idea to bring food. Everybody loves food, especially when it's free. As group leaders, choose your seat wisely. Sit where you can see the whole group. Get to the room a few minutes early to set up and then greet the members who are coming in. Start on time and encourage your members to be on time. Start with what your group has accomplished since the last meeting. This shows your members that your group is not a waste of time and you are actively doing things in your community to abolish abortion. Be sure to thank your members who have done things between the meetings. And then get on to business. As a leader, be decisive. You control the conversation, and it's your job to keep the meeting on task. Don't be afraid to shut down disruptions. Say, good point, but we need to stick to the agenda. Why don't the two of us discuss this after the meeting? Let's table that for this week, but we'll put it on the agenda for next week. Now that you've identified problems and solutions, use this time to delegate tasks. End on time. If the meeting needs to go longer, say, the meeting is officially over, but anybody who wants to talk about this is welcome to stay. Before the next meeting, follow up with people who had assignments and make sure things are getting done so you have something to report on in the next meeting. Check back in a few weeks for our video on why agendas are important. And don't forget to hit subscribe.